day while Senegal is holding a constitutional referendum. African Union Commission Chairperson Dr. Nkosaza Nathamini Zuma has called for smooth, peaceful, transparent and credible polls. Elections are being held in Congo Brazzaville, Benin, Cape Verde, Tanzania's semi-autonomous region of Zanzibar and Niger. Niger's president Mahamadou Issoufou is expected to win a second term in the vote against former prime minister Hama Amadou, who was jailed last year. The incumbent Mohamed is seeking a second five-year term as he is being challenged at the polls the first round of elections in February. Amadou has been forced to campaign from behind bars after being detained on November 14th on baby trafficking charges he says are bogus and aimed at keeping him out of the race. Just days before the vote, he was evacuated from prison and flown to Paris for medical treatment, with the government saying he was suffering from unspecified chronic ailment. On Friday, Amadou's doctor said his condition was getting better, but added that he would have to remain under observation for at least 10 days. Niger's history is dominated with military coups and has only had a multi-party democracy since 1990. The run-up to the first round vote was marked by violence between supporters of the rival camps and the arrest of several leading political personalities. Polling stations were open at 8 a.m. and will close 11 hours later, after which the Electoral Commission has five days to announce the results. The Center for Disease Control has raised the Zika virus alert.